Part 10, here we go. New aperture. Yes. We are in a new age. An age of, of circles. Getting more 70s. Yes. Old school. <laughs> I wonder if that's on purpose, if they start to lose their circle over time in their logo. $60. Because right if you notice, it's not a full circle in the, the, you the main. Out of here with down I'm sure there's a reason behind all of it. Yes. Knowing this Val. is another one of those rooms that... There, I will give them uh, Valve credit. There were some chambers that were probably, I actually suspect, unchanged because they were hard. Yeah. This is one that was took a bit of thinking. Yeah, I think the idea was not to make all the rooms super crazy difficult. Yeah. With some variety. Which I think is the right strategy to take. I like that there were yeah. at least some, though, because I, like oh, yeah. I like being challenged. It would be nice to see, you know, there was master levels for Doom 2. I'd be down for a master levels for Portal 2. That'd be pretty sweet. Any Doom fans in the house? Anyone? Oh, yeah. I am a dude fan. There we go. Boing. I, I even downloaded the Wolfenstein iPod app. Got played all those levels. I played that thing. Like, oh, man. Fucking old school Wolfenstein. That's a tough game to play. Not because it's difficult. It's just so... I don't, I don't, I don't know. It has an age It actually rate. is pretty difficult. When you put it, it on the well, it is, but... Oh, my God. If you lose your guns in Doom, you know, they're, they're somewhat easy to get back. In Wolfenstein, if you lose your guns, there's only like three guns. Yeah. You're it's... so in trouble when you have a pistol only in Wolfenstein on hard. It is, it's a game that hasn't aged gracefully, I'll say that much. But it's a landmark. A landmark in gaming no. history. Oh. J the guy's name in Wolfenstein is John... Blaskowitz. Blas ba Blaskowitz. Blaskowitz? Well, they pronounce... It's... I don't really know the exact pronoun pronunciation. I, some people say Blaskowitz or Blaskowitz. Okay. I love a game where killing Hitler is not even the end. <laughs> That's true. That's it was true. only like midway through the original game. Yeah. We need someone worse than Hitler. How about uh, this made-up character, doctor, whatever. You know, like. Also, like movies that kill Hitler. Uh, other things, you know, like movies, uh, Inglorious Bastards. Yeah, I was just thinking it, man. So that's a complete that end of that return great to Wolfenstein, ones, plus we're that new one they made several years ago. Frankly, you ought to be paying us. I, yeah, yeah, Return of the Wolfenstein was too. Was Hitler wasn't in that one, though. Probably not. We did already kill him. Well, I don't Thank know if this you. is in the same Unless they wanted to do zombie Hitler. For staggering well, Hitler was in, he was referenced. Like, I think it's assumed that he's alive in that, in that game, in that timeline. But, but yeah, Hitler is not, does not make an appearance in Return of Wolfenstein. Guess what Wolfenstein. Please pick them up now. We don't want 78, yeah, we're getting, the getting up there. Thank you for loitering, for not loitering longer than 20 on. minutes. <laughs> See, it's the same elevator. I'm telling you, that's the same <laughs> yes. elevator. I'll have $60 worth of beard dirt. Beard dirt. Yeah, elevator to surface, do you see? When you get these, these little voice clips from Cave Johnson where he's talking about, like, just hints that there's test subjects are just homeless people they just pulled off the streets. I mean, yeah, they, he's getting more and more desperate for test subjects. Exactly. Why, why was the delta literal. level before the gamma level? Because <laughs> you're going I, up. I was, I was in but isn't picture. gamma before delta? Caroline, Caroline, yeah. Caroline, so yeah. why why is gamma? Did they not do the research? Just gamma. They had alpha chamber. They had beta chamber. Then they had a delta chamber. And now we see gamma chamber. Weird. I wasn't paying attention, honestly. I didn't. I wasn't sure if we entered that room or if we just saw it as passing. Well, yeah, I showed them on the walls. Oh, I don't know. I, I I did not catch it. Might have just been an oversight. Maybe it was on purpose. Or no. Maybe it's, it's all. Here it is. The last gel. Spewing it everywhere. Spewtum. And it's yeah, the can the portal conductive gel that is so exploitive. Now, talk about the moon surface rocks because that's what I was talking about earlier in the beginning of this game when those wa uh, portal walls are broken open you yep. see um, what is supposed to be moon rock in a sense which is what yep. used to allow you to portal yeah, yeah. Uh, they grind moon, the moon rock is a, excessive, or a very good conductive surface for the portal technology yeah and so it's just very that's... interesting when you when, when you, go, you go back and replay the game and you see you know what kind of little tidbits they put in early on as references to later mm -hmm. That's one I bet most people, you know, didn't realize the first time. Maybe even missed. Oh no! But you know, nobody had any idea. Yeah, yeah, there was no. No, idea. but I mean, like, 
the second time too, I wonder if how many people caught it. Well, I, it makes me want. I, I bet there aren't any side effects to the movie. Ah so. shit! I bet not. Oh god. Yeah. I don't die a lot in this. Oh, Portal One stuff. I don't die a lot in this uh, playthrough, but. <laughs> yeah, playing it the second time through, it's it's definitely a lot more forgiving. Oh what yeah. Bird. Okay. Oh, I should be putting that wrong clip in again because I'm doing the wrong thing here. How so? Well, this is not what you're supposed to do. Wait, it's too much targeted. <laughs> no, past me. Don't do this. Boop, beep, boop, 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 beep, boop. Boop, <laughs> beep, boop, beep, boop, beep, boop, beep, boop, beep, beep. Come on. Come on, past me. <laughs> Come on, you know what to do. We've been through this. Oh, I think I'm getting an idea. It's terrifying. <laughs> and there he goes. There we go. Welcome to the original. <laughs> yeah, like a boss. This is your favorite part, Alex. I know it is. Since making test participation it's one of what are many favorite parts. The quality this of isn't it, though. Has risen oh, by the way, this is another early Boy, reference. However, yep. Has not. <laughs> As a result, you may have heard we're going to all sets human testing. Itself. There's still a few things left to wrap up, though. Now, the bean counters told me we literally could not afford to buy seven dollars worth of moon rocks, much less seventy million. Bought them anyway. Ground yeah, so here's the here's the thing. I guess, guess I spoiled it, but ground yeah, the moon rocks are pure poison. So yeah, the, um, if you sit, in the beginning of the games when you see broken open walls, the, that, the thing you're so seeing now, is moon rock. We're going to see if jumping in and out of these new portals can somehow leach the lunar poison. Out oh, of the, the beginning of the robot street. replacing humans part. Lemons, make lemonade. <laughs> <laughs> Let's Early on, they pretty much say it's like, I love this one. Yeah. That's what it's like. Early on, they admit it's like, honestly, this is pretty uncharted territory for science. We're just throwing shit at the walls and seeing what sticks. <laughs> if you survive and you don't have cancer, well, hey. that L to an R, it becomes very dirty. You have fulfilled your monthly test self erection yes. quota. <laughs> I punch those numbers into a calculator, it makes a happy face. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's one of my favorite parts. But but my everyone's favorite line is coming up. Uh, mm -hmm. It's it's a little while, but it's the involved. yellow fruit one. Uh, yes, and certain actions involving them, and I couldn't. I'm of course talking about <laughs> yellow pears. Yes. Well, that is disappointing. Doesn't sound appealing. Mm, yes, sounds delicious though, because I'm quite hungry actually. <laughs> And this is the this room, is the room that I crazy. Oh yeah, yeah. I uh, went crazy, and then I, I did this without doing it the most, the way that you were supposed to. Oh, yeah. I don't think I did it the way you're supposed to either. Efficiency was not my goal. With this I game. may do it the way you're supposed to now, but the way I did it, uh, if I can see, I, I portal things up to the wall at, that you're supposed to, here. But then, I I portal I put myself onto one of those spots. Like, you're supposed to shoot out of that little, um, tilted one. That's not what I did. What did I do? Oh, actually, this what, what do I even do right now? No, though this part I did right. It's one of my favorite, like, when you realize that you can do that. Like, have it jump across the wall like that. It's fucking brilliant. Yeah. Great test design. God damn it, Valve. Why do you gotta be so awesome? It's not fair. <laughs> no, right. It's not fair to the other game developers out there. You know, I played through this, I played through Half-Life 2 episode 2, the next game I'm gonna, I'm gonna play, it's just gonna feel empty and boring. What's Plus the fucking Half -Life 3. Oh, don't tease me right, like that, so Justin. That, no, that little spot, uh, you're supposed to put the white gel on that. <laughs> oh, man. There we go. Oh, <laughs> not quite. <laughs> Good. That would've been a pretty slick save, no, I though. I think what like, I did yeah. was... I, I, okay, I used the white gel on the floor beside that spot to jump up to it. Uh, yeah, that's what I did too. Yeah, yeah, I didn't go on the tilted one. I went on in front of it, jumped up to it, and then of course jumped across, right? Yep. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of ways there to do that in this game. Lemons, trying to give you white gel. Make lemonade. Make life. Take the lemons back. Get mad. I don't want your damn lemons. What am I supposed to do with these? <laughs> Demand to see life's manager. Make life rue the day it thought it could give Cave Johnson lemons. Do you know who I am? I'm the man who's gonna burn your house down. 
with the lemon. Oh, I like this. With the lemon. <laughs> <laughs> to invent a combustible lemon that burns your house down. <laughs> <laughs> if we can store music uh, okay, on a compact I like this disc, guy. why can't we store a man's intelligence oh and personality on one? Okay, so I I'm happy now. I can die happy. Now. Brain mapping. Artificial intelligence. We should have been working on it 30 years ago. So now we see a little this. more insight into how GLaDOS became, so became GLaDOS. Yes. Times a day. If I die before you people can pour me into a computer... I like they're pouring. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's like it's like uh, uh, Zoolander. It's in the computer. Like There's that, nothing in know. there. Where are the files? And he no, smashes the computer. computer. I don't care. All right, so you guys not seen Zoolander? <laughs> I have. Oh yeah, long time. Yeah, when the files yeah. are in the computer, and so he <laughs> takes the computer and throws it at the ground, and breaks it open. Yes. Oh man. Another another man. chamber that had me. I don't even know what. To, I didn't even know what to do for a while. Oh, the man who's gonna burn your house down! Oh, that escalated quickly. And completely. Boom. Now we're actually reaching the, the end of yeah. old aperture. Getting very close. The numbers on the walls are indicating we're, we're gaining altitude. I, I, um, is this the elevator shaft yet? I believe this, this is the. Oh, is it? I think, you know what's funny? I think. Even after old aperture, we see the elevator shaft again. Near to the end of the when we reach Reetly, we see the shaft again. I think. I'm just telling you, I'm almost certain that shaft appears a lot in this game. Well, I know that it's shuttered in all the all the spots leading up to this, and there's like a shuttered until, and then it has like a date thing that's been left blank. So supposedly it's like they were just like, no, just fucking shut it down. Cause... Yeah, I'm just saying we we pass areas because you notice we're not actually going horizontally we're going up so it's not unfeasible that we can in our journey continue to see that that elevator because right. we keep passing the same areas in a vertical fashion right that's the moving aspect that makes you miss the portal oh, I just did but I didn't like this room it was annoying because every time you miss you have to start all over and portal back and back and back it's a little lengthy this and a couple rooms later is also one that I, I, my original assumption for the solution was so obtuse and stupid. I, I still laugh when I think about it. <laughs> I'll be sure to point it out You're, when we get there. I don't think it's, it's I, I, this room only has one solution, though. It does, but yeah, it, it does. It's it's just, my original assumption for the solution was just yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm not ashamed to admit it. That right there what? is probably the part <laughs> that trips up most players. It's it's coming up. I'll be sure to point it out when we get. Oh, this back. this part was oh my god. This right oh, here. Oh, you're gonna have fun watching me do this. Oh boy. If it's it, it can't possibly be anywhere near as embarrassing as mine. <laughs> we shall see. And keep in mind. <laughs> oh, I see we've. Oh, uh, oh, good. We've turned the speed up. Yes. Yeah. Keep in mind, I've played this game before too. Right. Yeah. Yeah. This is not the first playthrough. Still, it's. I'm flailing around end. like an idiot here. That is the appropriate response. Now I'm wondering why I can't portal onto that wall. Why I can't I portal onto that wall again? <laughs> I like the the speed gel on the horse, the vertical piece. That's a good touch. <laughs> it's like in case you want to run really quickly horizontal or vertically. I, I think it's a good call. Yes. My unbiased opinion. I don't know what I just did there. Oh, ouch, the wall. <laughs> now we're, oh, no. It's still working! Oh boy. This damn Here we go. Here we go. I have faith. Oh. I regret nothing! Boy. Now is part two, of course. We got, we got like one minute left in the video. Let's see if you, I, I assume he wraps it up. Probably so. Stunning conclusion. I like it's speed gel on the side there. Uh, I can't remember. There must be. Oh, I guess that's where it's trickling down. Yeah. Well, it's fortunate for us that Aperture decides to not check their pipes very often, because otherwise we'd be kind of screwed. All these <laughs> <down>. <laughs> I saw that. Yeah. Oh, nice. There we go. 
Oh, right. No, I crouched. Boing. Oh, shit. If you crouch, you don't you gel don't do it time. to you. Uh, or at least, I mean, the repulsion gel doesn't work if you're crouching. That's how you yeah. land on it. I don't know how that works in, in a logic standpoint. If you science. crouch, you don't bounce. <laughs> because science. This is one of the hardest chambers just because of the angling. Once oh, you yeah. get it going, it's pretty easy, but it's hard to get it going sometimes. So, so if you're like me and Justin, you just gel the fuck out of it and hope for the yeah. best. Yeah, pretty much. But we'll see you guys in the next part. Indeed. And such a such thing. I agree.